Hello guys, girls, and everything in between. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm reading myself. So what I have here is I thought I would go back through some of my old videos and read myself to film because I just wanted to see how far I've come and everything. So I've got a video here. This is the uh, re-upload from Femme Ferocity. This was a channel that I was on, if anyone remembers, many, many moons ago, about 10 years ago, and it was so fun. And this was a makeup look I did in 2013. So Headphones on, and let's get reading. Now, I haven't seen this. Ooh. Okay, girl. Well, you think you're all that. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Oh, this was so fun. Oh, my God. I love Femme Ferocity. This was such a great time. I learned so much. Wednesday, I was Wednesday. Hey, chickadees. So, um, oh, girl. No topic okay. This week, um, I guess everyone's busy and stuff, but no one just. Okay, so it's not that bad. Like the only so, thing I would probably really hold yeah. myself up on if I walked yeah, into this room right now would be those. Sharpie brows. I bet you I used a black eyeliner for those. That was such a thing that I used to do. Oh my god, girl. Tutorial, which was featured for do. Let's get Okay, we are. It's a minute really fifty in, and you the makeup begins. My um, God, get to the point, red, girl. A white, um, a black, and some gold glitter. That's essentially it. I'll go through each product specifically. I'm out of focus. Wait, focus. Masker, which is focus. Focus. Um, okay, that's why it's not focused. It's a shimmer in it, but it's. Oh, I love it, Masca. I've still got that. You could use whatever you've got lying around. Um, I've got Carbon by Mac because that is the best black I've ever used. Um, no, it's not. <laughs> wow, girl, you have so much to learn. For like a bunch of them, very very cheap. And then the last blah, one blah, is blah, Moonflower, blah. which is powder eyeshadow by Illamasqua. Which oh looks my god, stop talking! Um, obviously, it looks really creamy in this yellow light. So I've but spent this almost half of this video so far out of focus. Shimmer. What the That's fuck? Really pretty as well. We can use that for a brow highlight. Um, Some added extras, which you are cheap. So okay, let's have a look at this blend. Okay, so you can glitter. see there that the glitter has stopped very suddenly. There, I think. Girl, you need a bit of a transition colour in there. Something to fade that out into the red. Look how harsh that line is. <laughs> now, once that is applied, we're going to blend it upwards into the brow bone, uh -huh. preferably up outwards as well to create that beautiful sort of a wing, sort of a lift. Yep. And we... So, continue. I tend to, oh, I tend yeah, to hold my skin a bit up, caught when I blend like this as well because it gives me a little bit more control and prevents that sort of hideous sort of overlap creasing that can happen sometimes when your skin's sort of looser, you know, like it, it sort of, like the brush sort of skips over a part of skin and then... Oh, I do a lot of talking. Even wow, like look at that fallout. Oh, oh and then my just blend, 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 blend. And this tends to do... My for God, I look like I'm looking at a topographical map of Utah. Uh, look at that forehead. Uh, I'm out of focus. I'm not even in the camera. In. Pull your head up, bitch. Oh, no one good. can see what's going on. Okay, that's pretty much that. Okay, so once that's done, we're going in right, let's with get Moonflower. Moonflower, like so. Oh. Oh. God, glitter. What do they say? Glitter is like the herpes of makeup. You never get rid of it. That into my upper mm, lash line. That's actually a paintbrush that I picked up from Right Art and Craft. Just to really draw attention to that section and really give a little bit more oomph. Don't stretch the skin. Doing this. Don't stretch the skin, really honey. Sort of Girl, this is why I have wrinkles now. Night look as well, just because it's a little bit more Okay, the, the main thing I'm seeing in this, aside from the makeup, is the fact that I'm doing it all like this. I'm like, okay, so I'm going to put on my eyeshadow. Ready? It's good, isn't it? Do you like it? Like, the, I had no awareness of where the camera was. Just, there's a little bit more depth into my eye. Okay. Next, I'm taking Smolder by Mac. I mean, it's still very pretty, pencil, but oof, girl, it is crunchy. Around. Then I'm taking Smolder by Mac, and I'm just going to set that liner again. How does this makeup brush. look? Take twelve minutes. How? It's literally just some gold that you slapped on the lid, and you've just done a crease. Yippee! Like so I can't wait. I need to skip sure to the brows. I need to see the brows. So that's pretty 
Okay, so I skipped through the brows. Oh my god. So brows. You can see it. I bet you that's smolder. I bet you that's smolder by MAC that I've got on my brows. Look, considering this was 10 years ago, I'm actually not that shook. I thought I would be more gagged. The eyes definitely need work, but hey, that's okay. I mean, my skin looks good. Yeah. I think this makeup look would kind of look nice, like in the dark of a club or something like that, with lots of lights reflecting off it. But under these kind of situations, ooh, the shimmer. Ooh, girl, it needs work. It needs work. Let's just chill. Wow, that was a blast from the past. Femme ferocity, oh, great times. Terrible makeup that I did, but you know what? That was part of the play, and that's how I've gotten to where I am today. So if you want to see more of me reacting and reading the hell out of myself, please let me know in the comments down below. And I will talk to you all very soon in my next instalment, and I hope you're having a splendid day. Mwah, bye. Hey, squirrel friend, when one video ends, just open up another one. It's called binge viewing. Go ahead. I support you.